So crystal clear the video. Thank you. Maybe I should use this more so people see the uh, like the quality of a live stream. So actually, I should. Do I have this? Okay, yeah, I should put this this long time ago. So this is a uh, Frank here doing a live 4K demonstration with the four Yolo cam and uh, my computer. And this is the main camera I'm uh, currently looking at. And this is the overhead shot, as you can see. Normally, I create this uh, news layout, so I'm uh, been doing demonstrations. And this uh, here's the background camera, which shows a little bit uh, the setup. I hope this is a wide shot, super wide shot, so people see everything from this. And uh, this is the side cam over here, side cam over here. And uh, sometimes when I want to just uh, read something, I use this camera to be uh, more natural, maybe. And I also wish this is a more wide shot. We so we will trick like trick a little bit more. And I ha I also have a computer here. So thank you for the comment and let let me know the about us. It's a uh, probably one of the uh, industry's first and only 4K video switcher. The like the real 4K video switcher that you can stream and uh, record separate separate isolate isolated isolated resources and uh, the reason why you should go to 4k as you can show from the picture when you record a podcast or when you record a uh, music concerts you rec you stream uh, sometimes you stream at 4k or record at 4k then you want to repurpose it or your client want to Make food, take food, uh, for advantage of the uh, recording and uh, doing some uh, vertical content. So if you are recording at uh, 1080p, then the cropped uh, vertical content will be 720 at m maximum. So to repurpose it at uh, for Instagram, TikTok, for like this is a more really like a future proof. Maybe three years later, the industry standard all of a sudden become a 4K. Then your switcher become obsolete, just become obsolete. So uh, I'm also very proud. The big companies, the A10 Mini, Extreme, G2, when they release a new product after so many years, it's a still a 1080p. So we don't want to find the excuses for ourselves, whatever reason it is, or they want to make it a uh, the cost wise or the CPU comp like. Uh, like limitation wise we don't want to find an excuse and also really proud that we are breaking break the boundaries when the the big comes to fail to innovate uh so it's so it's a future proof also future proof your content equipment so you can repurpose it in future and uh, and as you can see from here the it's like super great quality 